Hi guys, welcome to Java Coding Interview Questions. Uh, in this tutorial, we will see how to find uh, reverse of an array elements. How to find or how to reverse the elements in an array. Okay. First, I am creating a class. And I am naming it as reverse array demo. And I am writing a main method inside it. I'm writing a main method inside it. Scanner sc equal to new scanner of system dot in. Scanner sc equal to new scanner of system dot in. So first, uh, I'll explain you the program what we are going to do as we have to reverse the array. First, what we need is we need an array size and we need array elements and then we need to reverse the array. So in order to do that, first we need to create an array with an elements. So in order to create an array with the elements, we need array size. So we'll take the array size from the console. We'll take the array elements from the console and we'll reverse the array elements and we'll display it to the user. So for that first I am creating a scanner class. Why the scanner class is used is it is used to take the input from the console. And then after that let's write an uh, statement here which will explain you what this line does. Create scanner object for taking input from console. So this scanner object what it does it takes the it helps us in taking the input from the console. And then enter the number of elements. Okay, so we enter the num. I mean, enter the number of elements with which we need to create an array. Okay, and capture the number of elements. So I am capturing it in num. Int num equals to sc dot next int. So this element, this line is helpful in capturing the capturing the number of elements into num. Okay. So this statement will is helpful for that. And then, so what we need to do is uh, we need to create an array. So third step is what create an array. Now we got the size. So what we need to do? We need to create an array with that size. With size num. Okay. So which array we need to create as we are capturing integer elements. We need to create integer array. Int a equal to new int of num. Num is nothing but the size of the array. Okay, this is done. And then, so after creating an array, what is the next step? We need to read the elements that are given from the console into this array. Okay, so now what we need to do is read the elements into array. System dot out dot print align. enter the elements into the array okay for int i equal to 0 i equal to 0 i less than num i plus plus why I am giving num here num is nothing but the size of an array okay so array of i equal to array of i equal to scan sc dot next int that means whatever the input we are taking so I will explain you this for loop what is the purpose of this for loop is we are create uh, we have created an array in this line so we need to 
we need to initialize this array with some values okay so how are we initializing by taking the input from the console so so what we are doing is we are iterating through the array and we are storing the elements at each position in the array so first it will loop to a of 0 a of 0 equal to sc dot next end so whatever the value we hunted in the console for the first i mean first value it will be stored in a of 0 and the next value is stored in a of 1 and it is repeated till the size of the array okay and then so uh, till now uh, we haven't started the actual logic of reversing the array what we did was we have created an array we have initialized array now what we need to do is we need to reverse the elements in an array okay uh, suppose if i have three elements called 10 20 30 in order to iterate over it 10 20 30 what we will do we will uh, iterate the array starting with the index 0 starting with the index 0 and then with the size length minus 1 we will iterate over the each element in the array okay so but here i want to reverse the element in an array so what we do is i'll take the element from the last index and i'll print i'll take the element from the last index minus 1 and i'll print so i'll iterate the elements in a reverse order instead of starting order so that we can reverse the array very simply without any hurdles so so what i am doing is now uh, now i'll write one statement system dot out dot print ln printing the reverse element in the array printing the reverse elements in the array so for int i equal to 0 for int i equal to length minus 1 int i equal to array dot length minus 1 i greater than or equal to 0 i minus minus system dot out dot printl and a of i ok system dot out dot printl and a of i so for int i equal to a dot length minus 1 a dot length minus 1 is the last position i greater than 0 i minus minus system dot out dot print ln a of i that means here what we are doing is we are taking the elements from the last index and printing and again we are decrementing the value of index and again we are printing so suppose if you have elements as in an array as 10 20 and 30 what we are doing is first we are taking the element at an array 30 which is nothing but a dot length minus 1 and then we are printing 30 and then we are decrementing the i so then at that time i will be 20 and we are printing a of i and then we are decrementing i again and again we are printing 10 let's run the program and see the output i'll show you i'll debug you for one iteration and i'll show you how it works So run a java application enter the number of elements i am not entering more elements i am just entering three elements and enter the elements in an array 10 20 30. so now uh, we have to print the elements in the reverse order that is 30 20 10 so that's how it's printed okay so it's very simple let me debug the program and show how it works so first what we are doing is uh, as we want to reverse the array first step what we need to do is we need to have an array with the elements okay so in order to create an array with elements what we need to have we need to have array size as well as the array elements so what we are doing is we are getting the array elements and array size from the console so this statement what does it does is it takes the input from the console f6 so it took the uh, enter the number of elements i am entering it as 5 okay i am entering it as 5 uh, somewhere the debug got stacked 
uh, why because it, we are taking the input from the console debug won't work properly but i can tell you how it works okay so when we enter the number of elements so when we enter number of elements as 3 so in num 3 value will be stored okay in num 3 value will be stored and here what we are doing is we are creating an array with size 3 we are creating an array with size 3 which occupies i mean which can store 3 elements and then in this step what we are doing is we are iterating through the each element in the array and storing the values which we are given in the console okay and finally we are printing the reverse element how we are printing by taking the last element from an array and then we are printing and we are decrementing the value again we are printing again we are decrementing the value and printing okay so hope you guys understand how to uh, reverse an element in an array thanks for watching my video if you like my video don't forget to subscribe to my video